Hello everyone. Dojo is an interesting note. I think it's going to be a really significant a component of what Tesla does if things work out the way Tesla hopes they do in the way that I hope they do. I'm personally, I'm really interested in the stuff that Andre presented, the architectural stuff, a lot of the simulation stuff is really interesting, and Dojo is a very meaningfully different way of approaching the problem of training neural networks. So if, if what Tesla was trying to do is just basically out NVIDIA NVIDIA or you know essentially doing exactly what somebody else was doing then yeah, it's a long road to hoe you know those that the people who have been working in this space who have their particular architectural niches staked out welcome back fellow enthusiasts to another captivating episode of Tesla Stock News today. We're embarking on a deep dive into the captivating world of artificial intelligence as we explore the battleground between two tech titans, NVIDIA and Tesla's Dojo. We are thrilled to be your guide on this exhilarating journey of the cutting-edge innovations and strategic moves that are shaping the future of AI computing. In this episode, we'll break down the complicated hardware of neural networks and look at the cutting-edge technologies that are powering NVIDIA's dominance and Tesla's ambitious entry into the market with Dojo. From inference to training to data centers to supercomputers, every move has huge implications for the future of AI and the companies competing for supremacy in this quickly changing landscape. So grab your favorite beverage cage and buckle up. Get comfortable and get ready for an exciting trip into the world of AI as we compare NVIDIA's Dojo to Tesla's. But first, don't forget to hit the like and follow buttons. According to sources, he's talked to James Duma, an expert in the field, expands the discussion to include data centers, supercomputers, and training applications. For example, over half of Tesla's current training capacity depends on NVIDIA technology. This includes the known 10,000H1100S units and other units that haven't been named. Such a large deployment is far beyond what Dojo can do. Tesla's own system, even though NVIDIA's H200 is coming out soon and data center skills are always getting better. There is still the question of how Dojo stacks up against Tesla. Is it a real competitor or just Tesla's protection policy? James mostly sees Dojo as an insurance policy to protect Tesla's reliance on computer technology. With the current shortages of GPS, depending on outside vendors alone could be risky. It's possible that Tesla isn't saying much about Dojo because they want to keep a good relationship with NVIDIA, which has a big market share and a high valuation. However, James points out that monopolies can hurt innovation and competition, and some people may see Tesla as a possible competitor to NVIDIA in the data center space. James thinks this view makes things too easy when it comes to building a complete data center. INF infrastructure like NVIDIA's takes a lot of time, money, and skill. It's not something that can be done quickly, even though Dojo's architecture for neural networks is more promising than GPS in many ways. James is still not sure that Tesla will be able to directly compete with NVIDIA's power in the near future. Due to Tesla's current goals and the complexity of the data center market, this kind of competition isn't likely to happen in the near future. However, James Duma, who has a keen eye for technological innovation, fully recognizes the huge potential that Dojo holds for him. Dojo is more than just hardware. It represents a paradigm shift in neural network design that is set to change the very nature of AI computation. Dojo Bast is a strong and specialized design that was carefully made to handle the complex needs of neural networks in the most efficient way possible. James thinks that Dojo is not only a rival to NVIDIA, but also a force for big changes in Tesla's ecosystem. However, a straight battle with NVIDIA might not be coming up soon. It's impossible to overstate how important Dojo is to Tesla's technological arsenal. Its creation shows the company's dedication to innovation, putting them at the forefront of AI research and development. Dojo represents Tesla's big dream for the future, a future where AI goes beyond limits and innovation has no limits. Its importance goes far beyond traditional competition, bringing in a new era of computer power and technological brilliance. In James's eyes, Dojo's role goes beyond the present, it's a beacon of hope and a testament to humanity's never-ending search for progress. Its abilities could lead to innovation and more progress in the field of AI, making Tesla a key player in shaping the future of neural nets. Hardware that works with neural networks is hard to find because there are so many different methods and goals 
from inference to training. However, Dojo's focus on large mattresses creates a new paradigm. While it is optimized for speed in certain tasks, it means rewriting existing software infrastructure to work with GPS, a monumental task given the large ecosystem that already exists. This software dependence gives established players like NVIDIA a big advantage because rivals have to not only match current capabilities, but also guess what future improvements will bring. Tesla's unique situation lets them go after even with these problems. Dojo is able to make good use of their internal resources because they only have to work on a few specific tasks at a time. Competitors, on the other hand, have to adapt old software to new platforms, which makes it harder for them to compete in a field that is changing quickly. This difference shows how much of an advantage established players like NVIDIA have, as their large software ecosystem helps them stay ahead in the market. Figuring out neural networks is hard and matrix operations are at the heart of neural network computation, while GPS are great at managing a lot of small processors for these jobs. Dojo is different because it focuses on large mattresses to get the best performance in certain jobs. However, to use Dojo, you have to rewrite existing software infrastructure that was made for GPU operations, a monumental task given the large ecosystem that already exists. This software dependence gives established players like NVIDIA a big advantage because rivals have to not only match current capabilities, but also guess what future improvements will bring. Tesla's unique situation lets them go after Dojo despite these challenges with a concentrated workload centered around specific tasks. They can leverage internal resources efficiently in contrast. Competitors face the daunting task of adapting existing software to new platforms, limiting their ability to compete effectively in the rapidly evolving field. This disparity underscores the significant advantage held by established players like NVIDIA, whose extensive software ecosystem further solidifies their position in the market. Dojo serves as more than just an alternative hardware platform. It's a strategic move aimed at reducing dependency on a single vendor and gaining negotiating power in the market. Moreover, it has the potential to outperform GPU clusters in certain tasks, albeit with significant investments in development and infrastructure. However, realizing this potential requires overcoming numerous technical challenges from designing the hardware to mapping neural network problems onto the new infrastructure. Yet amidst these challenges, Dojo represents a substantial investment for Tesla justified by the economic value of the tasks it can accomplish. While the road ahead is challenging, Dojo's unique architecture shows promise for solving neural networks on a large scale and sparking new ideas in the field. It's a big step in a field where not many people are trying to come up with truly innovative architectures for neural networks. And yes, it's like landing rocket ships and putting up 40,000 satellites to make sure cell phone coverage around the world. An endeavor that requires a lot of work and creativity, right? What does that make you think about Tesla? Well, whatever happens, investors are still bullish and confident in Tesla. But do you know who else is optimistic about Tesla? That would be today's sponsor. For Tesla bulls and people who are always on the lookout for the next big thing in the stock market, Seeking Alpha's impressive growth isn't just something to watch from the sides. Seeking Alpha has everything you need to know about Tesla. Tesla stock price goals when talking about Tesla innovation and everything Elon Musk thus he avoids the negative talk from the mainstream media. Seeking Alpha has the most pro-Tesla news on the internet. If you click on one of the affiliate links in the description and make a purchase, our channel may get a small fee. Thanks for your support. The current lack of talk about Dojo may not be because it is unimportant, but because of strategy concerns. It looks like no one wants to upset NVIDIA, and Tesla doesn't stand to win much by talking about Dojo in public right now. James compares Dojo to groundbreaking technologies like Hard War KE, saying that they often take time to reach their full potential. Could Dojo be on a similar path, waiting for its time to shine? There are hints that Tesla has been quietly using Dojo for specific tasks. Over a year ago, Elon Musk talked about production jobs running on Dojo, but he hasn't said much more about it since then. The automatic labeler, which took up a lot of Tesla's computing power, could be one of the jobs running on Dojo because it's fast and can create supervised training data. It makes sense for Dojo to be able to do this. Moreover, 
Tesla is still working on a second model, the Dojo chip shows that Tesla is still committed to the platform. And the updated cabinets seen in recent pictures show that work has been done since the initial AI Day reveal. This evolution also shows that Tesla is trying to improve their computing power. Dojo could be used for difficult jobs like video processing and evaluation, even though its current computing power may not seem very high compared to GPU-packed data centers that are already in use. As NVIDIA moves forward with projects like Blackwell, its ability to grow and improve should not be undervalued. Dojo can change and adapt to meet Tesla's growing computing needs in this ever-changing landscape. Dojo is not just an insurance policy. It's also a strategic investment that could open up new frontiers in AI computing. The conversation about Tesla's Dojo is an interesting look into the complicated dance of technology strategy and innovation. As we move through this landscape, one thing becomes clear. With Tesla's unique situation and unwavering commitment to excellence, Dojo is more than just a hardware platform. It's a strategic investment that could change the game in the field of AI computation. Dojo could lead to huge steps forward in neural network processing. But as with any technological marvel, there are a lot of questions. What big uses will Dojo have when Tesla uses it to its fullest? How will competitors react to this risky move? Most importantly, how will Dojo shape the future of AI and Tesla's place in it? We can't wait to hear your thoughts and opinions. Join the conversation and let us know what you think in the comments below. Don't forget to like. Also, sign up for Tesla Stock News to keep up with all the latest news until next time. Keep your big dreams alive in smart investments.